North America's native prairies were rich in stored carbon until the coming of the plow. As the area became the breadbasket of the world, much of the original carbon in the soil was released to the atmosphere. America's native prairie are really a phenomenal resource. It's actually one of the most imperiled ecosystems in the world. The reason they're imperiled is that they make good cropland. Once you lose this native prairie, you can never get it back. And what happens in prairie grasses is a lot of the carbon that's, that's produced by the plant is stored underground in the root systems. And that carbon will remain there and, and build up in mass as that prairie grows and is left undisturbed. And really the only way that it'll be released is if that land is tilled and exposed to the atmosphere. Ducks Unlimited's carbon credit program is an approach called terrestrial sequestration. So in essence, what Ducks Unlimited's program is doing is compensating the landowner for not releasing that organic carbon, for basically keeping it in the ground and then continuing to use the grassland as pasture or hayland. These are perpetual easements we're talking about. The landowners who want to participate in the program are compensated in two ways. One is there's a one-time upfront payment for the easement, for the grassland easement, that'll be held by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. At the same time, there's an additional payment for the carbon sequestration, and that results in a conveyance of the carbon rights to Ducks Unlimited, and then we aggregate them, bundle them up, and then transfer them to a third party that will sell it then on the carbon market. We're not looking for huge increases in grasslands, we just like to see what's there kept intact.